apparently no apparently the the arcane vgu is not singed they said it's somebody else i heard that from two different rioters that's not singed so if they lied and it ends up being singed i'll be very sad but most likely it's not singed so we'll see would you rush into ergot since he's not melee or ranged exclusively against ergot i don't know what i'm gonna do yet but i'm i am gonna do a lot of proxying this game uh if i can i didn't take any proxy runes per se but I think I'll be fine. I took Aftershock this game because it's good against Urgot, and plus I wanted to I wanted to have it uh, for team fights. Conqueror, I don't like that much versus Urgot. I don't think it's that great versus him because he kind of just beats you. You can run with Ignite and maybe fight him, but I'm not the biggest fan of it against him. Phase Rush also very good against Urgot. If you want to go Warden's Mill, it's also very good against Urgot to help reduce his damage. Anathemas is decent against him. We'll see what I do. Um, most likely I go Tabby here because they have Kane Urga. This guy's Ignite, I gotta worry about that. He also has Phase Rush. Let it push in. On my way. <laughs> After I get Boots, I'm gonna proxy quite a bit here. For now, I just let it push into me. He just gave me some CS. I shouldn't be able to get any. Thank you, Bone Plating. You destroyed Darius with the Season 14 Leandries? Hell yeah, dude. Bear in mind, like, we finally have items after three years, bro. I cannot, like, stress enough how terrible Demonic was. Like, not just for Singe, but in general. Like, having items is, is such a, it's such a boon. You know what I mean? Okay, watch this. The wave is down here. I just run straight behind turret here. So fast to proxy, bro. So fast to proxy. Just get right back here. And I catch the wave. Nice. I lose a few minions back there, but I do catch the proxy, which is more important. And now this Ignite Bozo is stuck under his turret. Or he just chases me like an idiot. And I run away. Look how he already he lost a uh, half a wave there chasing me right there. Yeah, proxying is definitely buffed because the run behind turret is so much shorter. It's so much shorter on both sides, not just blue side. So even though people are saying ranged top laners will be more common, it's like kind of okay because proxying is buffed as well uh, for Singe, so. Grab this, execute. Nice. Very, very nice. Build towards my tabbies. Get refill. It's nearly time. And because this guy has no TP to TP back in the lane. Does Singe need to do it at carry? Not right now, bro. Not right now. You can absolutely 1v9 games right now. In the current patch, Singe can and should 1v9 1v9 games, in my opinion, because you fi we finally have items. The phase rush Urgot, bro. I'm not gonna say low T, but it feels low T. That's okay. But look, you wanna stop proxy? You're gonna miss your you're gonna miss all your farm, bro. You wanna stop my proxy, bro? Doesn't even matter. I don't like that. I don't like that, bro. Okay, whatever. Jungler got what he deserves. All right, very nice. Very nice, very nice. Dude, these players are so egotistical. They, they're just like, oh, Singe, I can kill him, bro. Listen. Bro, listen. It ain't season 13 anymore, dude. It's a new season now. Is my season now, alright? Yeah, smartest game player. I think I just ult for these so we can get him with Zen. Dude, my jungler is playing topside. I could cry, by the way. My man knows the value of grubbies. I could actually just cry tears of joy right now. Oh, it's amazing. Oh, it's awesome. Oh, it's lovely. 
Or got freezing. Or got freezing. Who cares, bro? Who cares? Who cares? I just walk behind turret. What are you gonna freeze, bro? What are you gonna freeze, brother? Yeah, he just started pushing instead. Very nice. <laughs> Bro, don't be too happy, right? Well, no. <laughs> it's okay. They they always find a way to kill my joy, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna have as much joy as possible while I, while it's early on and I can I can feel safe doing it, right? <laughs> if they nerf everything later, who cares, man? Who cares? Let it be. I want to have as much fun as possible right now. But like the thing is though, you, like I said, even if they nerf stuff later, like the 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 concept behind our items will not change. Leandries is still there to give you ramping damage over time, which is what Demonic didn't do. Demonic was just like a static amount of percent damage, which is fucking lame. Leandries does more damage the longer they're in it. So like conceptually, it's it's a different item, which is really nice. You know what I mean? Demonic damage is very predictable compared to Leandries. Leandries gets stronger after a few seconds, so it's harder to play against it. Uh, IMO. Alright, you gonna try and stop my proxy again, bro? You're gonna lose your wave. <laughs> Look, he's losing minions, dude! He's just trying to stop, he's losing all of his minions! <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> yeah, bro. Nice. Nice proxy stall. You really showed me, huh? <laughs> yeah, you really you really showed me, dude. Good job. You're teaching me a lesson for sure. Dude, he's gonna miss CS again! Look at this guy! <laughs> dude, there's no way this guy is for real. <laughs> nah, it's over, dude! <laughs> no, dude, it's so done. Nah, bro. I, I, I'm I, a champion again after three years. Get out of here, man. Dude, I'm actually out-CSing him now. Dude, I'm gonna go Leandry's rush, actually. I wasn't, I wasn't gonna go Rally's first, I'm gonna go Leandry's. Nice, Jin Gaming. I, oh, by the way, I heard Jin is like super, super broken right now as well. Ocean Drag, very nice. Rampage. Let's go, bro. Okay, so Phage Kindle builds into what? That's Titanic, right? Oh, it's Cleaver. It's Cleaver's on Cleaver. Cleaver is nerfed, by the way. Cleaver is 24% uh, armor shred instead of 30%. Why is Jin broken? Apparently, he just, like, two-shots people with new items. I don't know exactly what he does, but he kills everyone very fast, so. Yeah, that's a very nice thing, is if people try to, like, camp you to stop your proxy, they actually lose CS now. Whereas before, like, a smart player could just, like, ignore you. And just or ignore the wave and just harass you constant, constantly, without really losing farm or worrying about it. Because the wave used to be so close to the to the turret, right? But now it's like oh, really far, or wave used to be close to the jungle, but now it's really far. So they actually have to worry about losing minions when they do that. I don't even care if I miss the cannon. Like, I get prior for Krugs or for uh, for Voidlings. Let's go, boys. And I am more than happy to ult for these again as well. And prep them for my Zen who's coming up right now. But I don't even need to, I just want to kill him faster, right? Jungler playing topside. We, do we get six grubs this game? We get six grubs this game, bro. And I get my uh, hunting guys as well. 
Does Jenna Titanic Hydra bug? I'm not sure, but apparently he just two taps people. Uh, Double if was playing him in Champions Q and it looked like ridiculous, so. From what I from what I remember watching. I don't watch a lot of streams, but he was absolutely shitting on Champions Q with Jin, so. What do grubs give? Uh, each grub gives you one stack of a buff that does true damage over time to turrets when you auto them. If you get five, it summons one Voidling to help you push. If you get six, it summons two to help you push. Watch this. Double Voidling action. <laughs> he just stole his own wave! <laughs> nah, Urgot's gonna rage quit. There's no way, bro. There's just no way, dude. <laughs> dude, this Urgot's gonna fucking quit the game. Alright, I'm out. <laughs> I'm gonna get my Leandres. You can have some plates, bro. It's okay. <laughs> dude, imagine going down in CS to a Singe who is... He's, he's losing CS to me uh, in CS, and I've, I've been skipping waves, and he's Ignite, right? Oh man, so good, dude, so good. To be fair, the Kane did just troll him super hard, but yeah. All right, I know he has no Flash Ignite. Maybe I fight here, we'll see. If he stays, I think I beat him with the Landry. We'll see how this one plays out. And if he leaves, then I have Voidlings uh, and six stack Grub to just push turret with. So I kind of just checkmate him here. If he fights me, he loses. If he stays, he loses. If he recalls, he loses. Oh my god. I still can't last hit cannons though. Some things never change. Look at this. Look, 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 look at the damage. See that little true damage tick? That's that's the Voidling buff. The more of him you have, the more damage it deals. This turret's gone, by the way. No! Oh, man. <laughs> the cane showed. I almost killed him, though. That being said, yeah. He still almost died. All good, though. Okay. So, the thing do I want to go armor here? Do I want to go Riftmaker? Riftmaker is still good against Urgot because it lets me, lets me fight him. Rylize is cheaper if I want Rylize. And Rylize is good against these three down here the Soraka of uh, Varus. Yeah, it's good against Kane as well, actually. It's decent against him. I think I just go for... I think I just go for Riftmaker, honestly. I'm going to be spending, spending this game fighting Urgot, so... So I think it's fine to go for it. Do you go Frozen Heart? Maybe later. I Actually, I played Dead Man's last game, and it felt really good, because it gives you slow, re slow resistance now. It gives 20% slow resistance. I want to go for this, but Zin's dead, so I'm going to chill. I'm going to go up here. On my way. With the W slow, big boy slow. Feel that he's and he's just dead. Champion. Love it. Nice. Okay. We go Rift Herald here. I can also just push for tier two as well with Grubbies, but I want to be here for my team to help, help make sure we get this. So help make sure we get this. I'm going to go push top here. I think Zin's got this. Yo, Sonny's like, thanks for the two months, man. I appreciate you, bro. Much love, dude. <laughs> Urgot just respawned. I think I can push this, though. Kill. My bot side stomping as well, which is good. Mix. Puts him in a bad spot. Makes it hard for him to, like, win fights against me.
I should have fought him there, I think. I did do quite a bit of damage to him, though. Bye bye. See how my Leandries, my items actually do damage? Dude, this Urgot is living in season 13. He's like, I can just walk at Singe and he can't do any damage to me. Nah. Fucking bozo. I actually hurt you now. Respect me. As it should be. Like if someone if someone stands in your poison for 30 seconds, you should be able to damage them, you know what I mean? Like I feel like that's fair. Right? Am I wrong? <laughs> oh, man. Void Grubs don't damage champions. They they damage turrets. They, they apply the dot buff. For what it's worth. To turrets. Or I should say they, they reapply it. I have a bit of a flank mid, but I don't have TP, so. Hard to make that work. It's nearly time. Or got mid, I take tier 2 top. Guy has no TP. At least I shove it hard. Game's locking up here. Oh, let's see who comes up here. It's Kane. Okay, I'm in a little bit of trouble here. I think I'm fine though. Walk out. Okay, save my R. Nice. Do I have Rift Maker? I have Rift Maker soon. I might have to wait a few seconds, but I do have it. Dude, if so, I was reading chat. Baus, Baus. What you have to understand about Baus is he is he is a very 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 insanely good player who griefs it for content. Because whenever Baus plays off stream, he hits challenger easy, right? But you have to understand when he's streaming, like he's playing for content and for fun, right? But but he's he's a really, really good player who is playing for content. And that's fine. I respect it. I respect the grind. He's a, he's a great player. Easily. No doubt. If you want to see videos of Baus tryharding to win, go watch his Korea climb, where he got where he got challenger in Korea. That that's Baus tryharding, and he hit that shit no problem, dude. I think I just I think I just beat this guy. Look, oh look at my damage on this dude! Oh my god, bro! Not even difficult. I just dumpstered him. Yeah, Singe loses that 1v1 for the last three years, by the way. Even with the item advantage, Singe loses that. But this, again, this is how it should be. My champion should deal damage. Don't gaslight yourself into feeling bad about having items. Feel good about it. We deserve it. Big damage, let's go. We deserve it, guys. Don't feel bad about it. Wait, Zin's here with me. I can just push this. I have Void Grub spawning again soon. They spawn every 15 seconds when you're hitting turrets. There we go. <laughs> he keeps dashing the wrong way. My man's panicking. Get his ass done. No worries, no worries. Eh? Okay, I got a GTFO. I need to buy. I'm gonna buy. I kind of want to go Dead Man's again, but Frozen Heart's so cheap. It's really good here too against him. I'm. I really like the new Dead Man's though. Slow Resistance is nice. Will give you a hard time in top lane, Vayne for sure. I, but I think Singe can like at least be competitive in the fewer matchup now. So I'd say Vayne. Right, let's see what armor items are fun for me here. I could do the Undying Despair item. Let's try that one for funsies. You Undying, whatever it's called. Or despair, their unending despair. I'll play this one for fun. This one gives you uh, a burst of damage every seven seconds that heals you. So it's like a, a 
similar to Sunfire, but only against champions and more damage and healing. I was gonna say it's ridiculous. I was just gonna say how it's ridiculous that we should that we feel gaslighted for feeling OP when our champion is doing what it should be doing. Yeah, exactly, right? Exactly. Literally exactly. We we shouldn't feel bad for having items ever. Because for the last three years we didn't have any items. For the last three years our items were garbage. And we didn't not only did we not have good items, we didn't have mythics either, right? So don't feel bad. The only time we had a mythic, I think that was like you could build every game, in my opinion, was Chem Tank. And they nerfed that item 38 times and then deleted it, so. Besides Chem Tank, your mythic choice was like always situational slash optional slash garbage. Like it never felt good to buy a mythic. I was never excited to buy a mythic, right? I'm very excited to buy Leandries though. <laughs> very, very excited. I can just pressure hard with with grumblings here. Oh, nope. I'm coming, Jenny. Into the goo. No, really? I didn't kill anyone there. Damn. All right, Lucian. All right, Lucian. I get one assist. Dude, who's doing all this magic damage to me? Oh, it's Zillion and Varus both. Okay, no worries. I was like, that's a lot of magic damage. It seems like there's a lot of magic damage in the game now. Like from items and, and just whatnot. I think, uh, do they have, what, do they, what does he have? Zillion has Ludens, Companion. That's the one that fires the six shots or whatever. Cool item. Yeah, and Stinged was not even the reason they nerfed Chem Tank. They nerfed it because of Udyr, uh, Volley Bear. Right? Stinged was like the champion that wanted Chem Tank because we needed it. Also, another strong mythic was Radiant Virtue, but Radiant Virtue felt like dog shit to play because it you made your damage like non- I would, I would rather have damage than be tanky. If it's up to me, every every time, bro, every time. Give me damage over tankiness every time. Why well, he phase rushed it? I can't get to her. He can though. Like I, I wanna I wanna have damage. I wanna be the carry. I, I wanna I wanna pog out, you know? Like being a tanky fling bot is fucking boring. Like that 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 makes me fall asleep when I'm playing. I hate it. And whenever being a tanky fling bot is the best way to win, it's not a fun game in my opinion. Even if you win with it, right? I pressure this a bit. Grublings. Look at my grublings go. I don't have ults, I don't want to walk over here. Dude, I push tower so fast with grubs. I guess I just go inhib because Kane's behind me and Urgot's down here, so. Kane is backdooring minions, or backdooring the wave. But we just killed this, so whatever, we leave. We leave, I buy unending despair. I'm gonna buy some MR too. I do not have ult here. Okay, I got a GTFO. Enemy has been slain. Down. I mean, I'm over here. Can't get to her. Or him. Damn, I missed my ult again. Annoying zillion. Whatever, it's fine. I leave. Leandre's in a jack show. Feels strong. I might try that next game. We'll see, though. I'm getting a rat recalled on, dude. I think we just killed this guy here, though. Nice. Okay, now I get to recall, hopefully. 
I can certainly see Dead Man's being a very, very important singe item this year. Because of the slow resistance, right? Okay, I need to get MR. I want to try Jack Show, but it's really expensive, so I might go Koenig Recurrent. So Koenig Recurrent combined cost is $24.50. Jack Show is going to be $27.50, so it's going to be cheaper. Oh, there's a Slash. Hope it was worth it. <laughs> Jesus, dude. Varus is a little... Little obviously still the best champ in the game. No worries, no problem. I could go belt eventually if I needed it. The cuckening! I can't get to him! What? Okay, whatever, it's fine. I get hit by the uh Urgot ult, unfortunately. Yeah, I can I can definitely see Dead Man's being a super important sandwich item this season. I mean Rallies is important, I'm just I'm just buying an ending despair to, to test it out. Maybe not the best game for it because they only have one melee champion, but yeah. On any despair, it does damage um, every seven seconds when you're in combat with champions in an area around you, and that damage heals you. Uh, problem is, they only have one melee champion, so yeah. I think I, I think what I do actually, I think I sit on Negatron Cloak and I build towards Rocket Belt here to have the gap closer. I, I think that's what I do. Going Rocket Belt? We're talking about Minish. It's a mythic item. You already have Leandries. True. <laughs> My bad. Dude, it feels so nice to have an item system that's there to help you instead of there to, to like, to screw you over. That's how it should be, though. Items should be there to help you instead of to, to like, make you feel bad. And for three years, we had an item system that was, like, it felt like it was there just to make us feel bad. Ah, rip. Oh, whoops. Fuck you, Minish Cap! Fuck you, Minish Cap! Oh! He played the last Sinch player. I gotta back Disgusting. out! Disgusting! We can get drag or end the game. We can do either or here. Right, we're already here, so might as well just take it. <laughs> You've fallen, Daddy. Thanks for the Prime, bro. Trailblazer? I have not tried that item yet. Let's see, Trailblazer. 250 health, 40 or five. Oh, this is this is the um the chem tank replacement, right? Or the uh, the righteous glory, the new righteous glory. You create a trail behind you that speeds allied champion movement speed up to 15% of yours. Your next attack discharges the move speed and slows the enemy champion. So this could be a, a dead man's alternative too. This does not give slow resistance though. On my way. Who's that sub voice? That's Shy Sept. That's my friend Shy Sept. I'm gonna rock a belt here. I think we're chilling. I do have Baron, and I have Voidlings here too. I can push pretty hard. My team is pushing up mid. Just gotta be careful not get caught here. Hmm, I had a Bard ult there, unfortunate. I thought he'd use it on me. All good, whatever. Also, just like didn't think that they would kill me there. So I guess my bad. Like, I saw the bard walking up, so I'm thinking in my head, in my head, like, yeah, surely he just ults me, right? That is not what happens. Like my my team over here is getting some work done though, which is good. You what? XD moment? Hello? See, this is why this is why Jin is broken. Like, this character just two taps people now. 
<laughs> Yo, what's up, Shai? I hope you're doing well. I like season so far. Incredible. Amazing. The In the first two games of season 14, I have had more fun than I have had in the last three years of League of Legends combined. Easily. I think I just beat this guy, by the way. I don't beat him, though. <laughs> oh, gosh. Varus is so balanced. My bad. I shouldn't have walked up. I should have backed out. All right. I have belt now. Unending despair. Yeah, this item does not seem good this game. They're just so ranged focused, right? I might sell it and get Dead Man's Plate. If I sell it, how much money? I get 2.1? Okay. I might have to do that for movement speed here. My what's up, I hope you're doing well. One of your friends called you a singed abuser. <laughs> Let me guess, did your did your friend play three years of Divine Sunderer? Two games in I'm having more fun since I started playing almost four years ago. Oh yeah. See, if you started four years ago, you have only a little bit of, of, of experience with the old item system. This is what this is what League used to be like all the time, where you could just buy the items that you wanted that would help you, right? <laughs> Minish Cap hacking with three mythics? True. I'm breaking the game. Okay, I have Rocket Belt now, so I should be able to get on top of the Varus through the Zillion Slows. It wasn't your friend, it was enemy Teemo. Dude, I don't know, Teemo, Teemo has amazing items now. Like Malignants, Leandries, all that stuff, right? Teemo Shrooms are going to be nuclear this year. Oh. Nice. Rocket Belt. I can just do that. I can just buy a Rocket Belt if I need it. I can just buy an item, and I if I want to have it, it's so nice. I'm using yeah, three three mythic builds, so broken. Like that's what's so nice about about the old item system, which is this item system, is I can have Leandries for damage, I can have Rift Maker for sustain, and I can have Rocket Belt to gap close. I, like I, if I want the item, I can just buy it, right? I don't I don't need to compromise. Like if you have the gold, you buy what you want. See, the problem in season 11, 12, 13 is I wouldn't be able to do that. Because I had Riftmaker or Leandries, I couldn't buy Rocket Belt as well. Or I could only buy one of those items, so it was garbage. Like, it was trash, right? But now, I can just buy what I need. And it's like, oh, it's so much better. It's so much better, dude. It's so much better. It's actually hilarious. <laughs> Minish Cap is holding his Dream Infinity Stone gauntlet with every item in it. Yeah, right? Got Diamond 4 in two games. Nice. Huge, bro. Huge. Absolutely huge. All right, let's see. Dude, the fact that I'm able to 1v1 the Urgot too is nuts. 33k. It's just, it's just so good, man. It's just so good. <laughs> Singed highest win rate champ in all ranks? Good. As it should be. <laughs> Oh, man. Imagine we wake up, it was all a dream. We have to go back to Imperial Mandate Trellias. Yeah, imagine imagine I wake up tomorrow, it was all a dream, and I have to build Radiant Virtue again. <laughs> I might fucking throw up, dude. I might actually just, just you know, throw up. Yeah, guys, don't be afraid of nerfs. If it happens, it happens. The important part is we have items now. After not having items for three... For three years, dude. <laughs> Should I re-download League? Do it. It's a, it's a great patch. Best patch we've had in half a decade, easily. Yeah, Cosmic Drive is really good too, right? See, that's the thing. That's the thing, Trucker. We have so many good items. That's what it should be like. Like, yeah, Cosmic Drive is amazing. You know what else is amazing? Leandries, Riftmaker, Rylize, Rocket Belt. 
Dead Man's Jack Show, Canic Recurrent, Abyssal Mask. Like, we have so many amazing items, dude. We have, like, 10 or 12 amazing items to buy. Whereas, we used to have none <laughs> for three years. <laughs> like, it's such a big difference, man. It's so good, dude. It's so good. Two games in, and I've had more fun than I've had in the last three years of League. Movement speed shards are next patch, I said. Next patch. 